What's going on? This is Andrew Privet, and welcome to Folsom, Maryland. Funny story going back to when he was in preschool, pre-K, at a school just across the way here. They had a graduation for them all, at five years old, and they all stated what they wanted to be. And Andrew walks up, gets his little diploma, and he wants to be a soccer player. So since five, since four and five, he's been kicking a ball. He's kind of never stopped. He was a pretty quiet kid from my point of view early on. And when he got into high school, he chose his high school for soccer. So that was the beginning of selecting places to do soccer with. My first start, which was in Dallas, it was that same complex where um, during high school um, with my club team, Baltimore Celtic, that's the same, same place where we were, we were playing and, and where we won both national championships. Um, even though most routes in the MLS come from the, the academies um, under MLS, um, I had a different route more on the club side um, and was playing high school soccer. I've truly enjoyed every, every day I had at Penn State. Um, I made some of my closest friends that um, are still very close to me that I chat with a lot and um, in college was just a really fun experience and also where I, I grew a lot um, as a player but then also off the field on my own you know um, further away from home than, than I've been um, just kind of figuring everything out studying um, getting my degree but then also just enjoying soccer and, and working on my game there. We are going to head down the road to the rec field where um, I basically just play soccer when I'm when I'm home in between college seasons in the summer. So it's kind of the the stomping grounds. It's a funny story. I was having dinner with my parents the uh, the night of the draft, just watching the first round go by and all the picks, all the stories. Um, as we're sitting at the table, just kind of talking about it, my dad asks, "If you got picked, what team would you want to get picked by?" And I was looking at the list and kind of just looking through all the teams. So I was like, "I think I think Charlotte would be perfect." So if there's one place I'd want to go to Charlotte and then come home, and I'm just looking at the ticker. I just see my name pop up, my dad screams, because it comes up, my name under Charlotte FC, my dad's screaming downstairs, I'm freaking out, and um, from there it was just, from that moment, it just kind of leads into the whole dream um, of a rookie year, and how, how everything's panned out this year. Center back was new this year, and then college gave me a lot of versatility where I kind of played just about every position. And then even growing up, um, on my first Folsom team, I, I played right back, um, and back then I was fast compared to everybody else, so they used to call me Wheels. I remember he was just really kind towards me, gave me a lot of confidence, and was just kind of giving me tips and just helping me out. Um, was telling me what I was doing well, you know, what I could do better. Um, and I think from that moment, I think back and kind of just think we had a connection from the from the start there, and then put side by side in the back and from then on uh, even though he's he's younger than me I talk about that a lot uh, which is hard to believe considering the experience I think I, I grew a lot into that role um, because of him um, he helped me a lot and uh, gave me a lot of confidence and I think we just formed a good partnership and we're always talking non-stop in the game and I think that's just where um, we just kind of have each other's backs um, a lot of trust in each other and just honestly enjoy enjoy playing playing together and taking little victories. When you were little I would drag yeah. you and April down here and over to the high school and watch the parades yeah. and make think, you sit on the side yeah. of the street. I yes. Mean, Fourth of July fireworks. Uh -huh. I think yeah. there's some down here. Yeah. Yes. Uh, park at the mall. Yeah. Parking lot. Watch them, but, but yeah, this is. I mean, there really is no downtown falls to you could show it, it's like a, a street, yeah, like this. <laughs> this yeah, yeah. Right. blink if you blink, you'll yeah. miss it, right? Yeah. But so. this has got an old feeling, which is, is nice, yeah, it's been nice for us as a family. Cool. Yeah. 
That's all I got for you guys. Thanks for visiting Folsom, Maryland, and I'll see you guys in Charlotte soon.